Hi, I'm Ryan from Barn3. And in this series of videos, I'm gonna show you how to install, program, and sync your aux pedals for your Eventides. When you receive your aux pedal, it will come with a small bag of screws, a sticker, a manual, and of course, the aux pedal itself. All the instructions that I'll be giving to you in this video and the future videos will be found in the manual. So if you have any questions, please feel free to refer to it. The first step in our installation process is going to be to take our even tie pedal and flip it over. We're gonna remove the rubber pad from the bottom of the pedal by starting at one corner and slowly peeling it away, being sure not to rip it. I'll also note at this point that if you have any Velcro on the bottom of your pedal, it's important that you remove that as well. I recommend that you hang on to this rubber pad so that if at any point in the future you want to remove your aux, you can always put this rubber pad back on your even time. Next, using a number one Phillips head screwdriver, we're going to remove the four outer screws from the outside of the even tide. We are not going to remove the center screw because this will hold the bottom plate on the even side while we continue the rest of our installation. Next, we'll take our aux pedal and while we hold the even tide at a slight angle away from the aux, we will insert the plug into the aux switch jack on the back of the even tide and we will lower it all into place. You'll note that once it's all in place, it's nearly impossible to pull this plug out. So that's why it's so important when you're installing or removing your aux to hold your eventide away from the aux at an angle. Finally, we're gonna flip the eventide and the aux over one more time. And we're going to insert the four screws that came with your aux into the four outer mounting holes. I recommend that you insert all four first and then loosely tighten them all to center everything up. Finally, you can go around one more time to fully tighten everything. And that's it. The aux is fully installed on your eventide. At this point, it's good to note that if you plan on using a separate tap tempo, you can install it using a standard mono quarter inch cable. Please be sure to check out the rest of our setup videos, including the programming for the foot switches and the tap tempo synchronization at barn3.com. Thanks.